Good afternoon and welcome back to the one that Celtic fans view. There's breaking a little a badder news kicking around this afternoon. And of course, it's just the, the the media headlines that's coming out of Scotland are absolutely ridiculous, as the, as you would expect. Um, Lila Bada lands Celtic loan transfer exit options as three English sides make a move amid challenging situations. And then it goes on to talk about the situation with the Palestine flags back in October, saying that it's, uh, it's unlikely Lila Bada will stay. When you look at the clubs, right, it's still in Celtic's hands. Pined a brand new contract with Celtic that runs out in 2027. The fact that Leo Labara uh, is a Celtic player, and I don't see him going anywhere this window. I don't see him going anywhere in the summer. Celtic star Abara has been a target for three English Championship sides, is another headline. And they want him alone. This is why it's never going to happen, right? West Brom, Southampton, and Watford want Leela Bada on loan. Who in the right mind? Hey, you've got to, you've got to admit, chance in it. Uh, you've got to chance your luck. Um, there's always the Daily Mail are kicking in as well. You see, it's the uh, what should you see here? And the media, yes, the media and uh, the current situation. That's all I'm going to say about it. Uh, the, the Mail, the Daily Mail are also saying that there's a League One side in France and a. Bundesliga side interested in the Israeli international. They've got to mention that he is an Israeli international. They seem to do this all the time, the media. They're, they're trying to just, and it's their, their agenda that they have just now, but we're going to keep politics out of it. But anyway, Abada recently turned to action with Celtic and uh, he was fantastic the, at the weekend. He was slotted right back into the teams. The report also states that um, he's found recent months challenging. How did they know? Because Nobody's actually had an interview with Leela Bada. Celtic haven't given any information about Leela Bada. And the only information that we had was back in October when Brendan Rodgers says that he went out for a meal with Leela Bada. If the situation is the same in the summer, um, and there's people going on, they want a six months loan and could offer time and space to review the situation. Shut up. This is the media trying to chase a Celtic player out the door. It's as simple as that. Brendan Rodgers said previously that he, 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 he likes Leila Bada as a player. He's comfortable with him and he says that he's got a bright future at Celtic. Brendan Rodgers has also come out and said that he's happy and he's settled here. You know, he's got the he's got the the shoulder and the arm of Brendan leaning around him and making sure everything is all right. And and other situations Yes, you would say it's not. It's not even news story wise. It's just a case that the media have got it in their, their thing to try and use the current situation in Israel. Um, it's not even Israel anymore, is it? Because that, that that's been just stay away from it. Stay away from it, Baz. We'll move on. Move on. There is other Celtic uh, transfer news that's kicking around that uh, Bologna are unlikely to sell. The one and only Sidney Van Hoydonk, and unless they can find a, a replacement for him, even though he's even not getting a game for them, they are saying that they need a replacement before they'll let him go. It's unlikely that he will be sold this January. So tell me what you think about the whole Lille Bada situation. Um, it's reared this ugly head again. Media are trying to make out that there's something going on when there's nothing going on. And, and, and you've got to admit, three clubs in question, Totally chancing the luck trying to get Lila Bada on a loan move until the end of the season. It is never going to happen. Absolutely never going to happen. If it does, I'll eat my shorts. And on that note, have a fantastic afternoon, Celtic fans all around the world.